Testing $1,000, testing $2,000. I've got uh, a website that will do the budget for you. <laughs> it's called budgetworksheets.org. And you can have a um, college student budget, a family budget of $3,000, $4,000, $5,000, $6,000, up to $10,000 a month. And you click on it. And it um, has the budget up there for the one month. And then I guess you have to wait until that month is over before you do the next month. And you only can do one worksheet at a time, evidently. And uh, you can make changes as you want to. But it does the budget for you. So <laughs> can you believe that one? <laughs> Now, uh, my budget, I did it. I have a perfect budget. Thanks to um, working with the Every Dollar Budget app, I've been able to get a perfect budget. Well, it's never going to be perfect, so, you know. Um, but I have to spend a lot of time concentrating on it, like I'm doing my budget for July, August, September, the third quarter. And it takes a lot of time because you forget about small details but I think I've got it now and I call it my road map because I know exactly what days I'm doing what um, what I have to do for each step and it's broken down and hopefully when August come all, all I have to do is change a few little things but not the whole thing so that's why I call it my road map so it, it takes a lot of time, but I like to do it ahead of time. Like this is the perfect time. This is June to get ready for July because don't forget, it's working on three months. That takes a lot of time. School is coming up. Uh, school, summer vacation. So it, uh, it takes a lot of time. And uh, usually I'll redo the budget about three times before I have come up with my final budget. But this time... Since I'm working on the third quarter, for the whole quarter, July, that's 90 days, July, August, and September, I've had to revise it like five times. I do it in my notebook first. And then, um, I'm so glad I found this. It's called work, budgetworksheets.org. And it's very interesting. It, it will, if you put in the amount of money that you have, it will break it down to uh, so you have some idea of how to go about making a budget. This is a very good tool, and I thought I would do a, um, a video on it and also talk about my budget. It took five redrafts and five drafts to do it, but I've got it perfect, and it's, uh, it's just perfect, perfect. July. I shouldn't have to change it until uh, the end of September, getting ready for the fourth quarter, because then I have to start preparing for Christmas. So um, it just, some people say it's time consuming. I don't know. I just spend a lot of time on mine ahead of time before I start spending. So um, this should be um, helpful to you want to look it up it's very interesting and like I said um, it has the college student budget because and that's the one that seems to appeal to me the most because you know you have to add color in your life you know and I, when I do my redrafts I use magic markers you know life is about using a whole box of crayons and uh, what so whatever you have if you have a three thousand dollar budget, which um, that's the smallest one. After college student, it's three thousand a month to ten thousand dollars a month. But it does it for you. <laughs> you can't ask for more than that. God bless you. Run and get your bills paid, and um, you know it's so nice. I was able to tell friends about my um, budget. Been able to help a couple of people. I increase the allowances that I give out to uh, relatives, and 
I couldn't do all of that. And then we have activities. We have the date night. We have a whole bunch of things that we do. I couldn't do that without being able to budget first. And it's such a joy. God bless you. Run and get your bills paid. Bye.